you have two monitors and only one HDMI port on your laptop, you can use a USB-C port if it's actually located on your laptop also. There's a USB-C hub that you can purchase, and I'm going to show that to you. As always, please click the like and subscribe button, and also click the bell to get notified of upcoming videos. And help me by improving the content by watching the entire video and commenting below. If you watched my other video of the Legion Wi-Fi 40 by Lenovo, then you know it actually has one HDMI port. It also does have a USB-C port that I can use to connect to my other monitor. This USB-C hub is created by XSPUS. It has four USB ports, and also a HDMI port and a USB-C port to connect to other USB devices. It's made of a durable aluminum alloy casting. This also has a temperature control chip built in to keep it cool so it doesn't overheat. It's not like your normal boxy USB-C hub. This one's actually smooth and rounded around the edges. The four USB 3.0 ports allows us to achieve a data transfer speed up to 5 gigabytes per second. On the other end of this, it has an SD card and a TF card reader so that you can read your cards from your camera or any other media device. The cable on the end is flexible enough to actually put it in any position so it can lay out of the way. Now, why did I buy it? To connect my second monitor. So let's go ahead and do that now. Alright, so here's the USB-C port. Also, I have my HDMI here. This is not a HDMI, this is actually just USB. Okay, so let's go ahead and hook up the USB hub. Okay, now that you have this currently fastened, let's go ahead and hook up the HDMI cable. So let's move it around here and make sure it's securely put into the HDMI port. Port. And come up to our monitors. That one's on and connected. This one's not connected yet. So I just gotta come over here and hit the adjust button and find the right port. And there. Now it's all connected and good. So that's how that works. I'm surprised. I, I didn't know that you could actually use an, a USB-C hub or even a USB-C connection to an HDMI to actually get this to work. Um, the USB-Cs are actually used for charging and data transfer. I didn't know that. I thought it was just USBs just for charging. I've had this for about a month now and it's worked fine. So if you don't mind actually hitting that like and subscribe button for me and also if you have any comments or questions leave them in the comment description below. Also there is a link in the description if you would like to purchase this device.